Hey, you tourists, it's your boy Domination. This is back of the basic. Sean gonna do this is with the text, baby man. It looks back, you know what this and this and this. Real men rust up, fake men rust down. Real world rust up, fake world rust down. Prep the word preacher, preach on. And today's top of the top, but it is the only place you ever gonna get it. Only place you ever gonna get it. Only place you ever gonna get it. Only place you ever, ever gonna get it. Only place you ever gonna get it. Only place you ever gonna get it is rapid basic. Chugging the deuces out of text, baby. Man of those back, you know this and this. Real men rise up, fake men rise down. Real world rise up, fake world rise down. Prep the word preacher, preach on. Um, choke, uh, uh, choke, no joke to Shaman of God. Don't s say fuck the hood. Look, I understand where you come from. I come from the hood as well. People died in the hood. We need to look at our actions. I'm, I'm sorry to say this, because if we keep on doing the stuff that we're doing, I got a feeling something is coming. And I don't think my folks are not prepared for that, because we're not going to fuck with people like Hell's Angels, people like Chinese Mafia, Japanese Mafia. People are not, I mean, I, I know my folks, they're not going to fuck with people like that. They'll fuck with certain people, but those kind of folks, man, these organized, argument gangster types to work with the cor corrupted government, no, they're not going to fuck with them type. Let's be honest. Look, I love the neighborhood. It's our behavior. It's our mentality. We need to get rid of that hood mentality. We glorify gangsters. We glorify drug dealers. We glorify hustlers, gangsters, and killers. And that's going to be the backfire of the black community. I'm sorry. You you can say what you want. Now, I'm not criticizing you, dude. I understand where you come from. They should give the resource of the black community. But my thing is this. Now I start to see why there's a real reason why Jay-Z don't want to give back to his community. There's a real reason. Because Jay-Z got beat up when he was coming up. And we need to start talking about this, how people mistreat folks and people need to be. And this goes out to any community. You have to be very careful who you treat people nowadays. And it's up to the so-called dudes on the Negroes in the corner. Y'all need to change, man. They, they looking at y'all actions. They look at y'all, y'all behavior. You got cameras. Uh, focus on you all the time. Most of them don't give a damn because they figure they can get away with anything. You can't get away with everything. Because it's the big brother monitor is watching you. they watching everything you do. Everything you buy. Everything you touch. Everything you taste and, and, and feel or, or can't see or smell. Everything you do. I ain't saying they're watching you, but I'm saying they 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 tap on your phones, they put you on your your radar, and don't think they ain't got no police file file of your records, and they can see you. I don't know why black men don't see this. I don't know why we 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 we've been taught not to respect authority. We've been taught that. I always respect authority, even though I don't always agree with it. Now, don't get me wrong. There are police mistreat people, and that do need to fix the problem with police department. That do need to fix it. But I'm sorry. You can't defend gangsters and what they're doing, and they've been known for killing babies. They've been known for raping women. They've been known for doing that. Choke, no joke. You know this, dude. You know this. If somebody made threats to you, you don't think you're going to handle them? You will. Let's be honest. Nobody wants to be threatened. Nobody wants to be disrespected. Nobody wants to be feel like they're not safe. I'm sorry. Most majority of people got to feel safe. That's just the way it is. You have to check. You have to you have to accept that. I don't know why, but I'm going to show you something. Remember Lupe Viasco, right? Remember Lupe Viasco? I'm going to show you. When Lupe Viasco will start crying all the people that he lost. All the people that he lost in Chicago. Where are these so-called gangsters at? And these drug dealers, hustlers, and killers. Look at the community that they cause. And they don't even have the nerve to say, oh, I'm sorry, I'm, I messed up, I know I'm wrong. They don't want to say that. How can I respect a man like that? How can we say that we, 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 we get mad at these?
these politicians, but yet you you just like these crooked politicians. This time they're not going to put us in prison camp. This time they're going to put us in torture camp and rip the flesh out of our skins. I'm telling you right now. And them dudes know it. And this is a big fight you're not uh, you're not ready to up against. Trust me. They will burn a gasoline and set your ass on fire. Trust me. I don't know why we want to fend behavior men. I'm sorry. We just can't. And you women that fend behavior, y'all stupid. Because you know damn well this fend behavior is just all it's going to do is going to get more worse. These thugs know deep down they're wrong. They know deep. I'm sorry. You mean to tell me somebody killed my brother, right? And I supposed to sit there and with the stop snitching, not say anything? No. I want for justice for my brother. If somebody killed my brother, because I'm going to start taking laws in my own hand. You think about that, man. I don't know why we like to pretend. I don't, I don't, I don't know. You will never see white people try to fit a so-called serial killer. Why is that? You will never see uh, Asian people trying to fend their people doing some stuff. Why are we doing that? I don't know. Because that's still our people. That ain't our people. I'm sorry. If a brother or sister that takes something from me, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to air them out. I'm sorry. Just like every other community. Because I'm not going to feel safe. Because first thing you be nice to people, what are they going to do? They're going to take advantage of you. And, and, and choke, uh, choke, no joke. You know this, dude. You probably been taken advantage by people a bunch of times. You know this. You want to live comfortable. You want to sleep at night. The violence got to stop. I'm sorry. Now, I don't like Sean May as a person, but Sean May, dude, I don't agree that point, but I understand what Sean May is saying that. Because the hood for what? They can kill you and rob you and gun you just as much as anybody else. It's so bad out there. You can't even order a pizza in your own streets, in your own neighborhood. Why? Because people are scared. They're going to get robbed and they're going to get killed. We're going to pay for this. This this lifestyle we embrace, we're going to pay for this. And you women, y'all going to pay for this too. That 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 being that 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 tough macho bacho, it's over with. You keep you keep fending this stuff and you're gonna have the same results. Yeah, keep doing it. Keep because the more your vengeance, the more you 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 the, the, the more you feel their pain. You don't care, you figure anyway, well, some people just doing it just to be doing it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. I can't I can't fend criminals. I can't fend murderers. I'll be a hypocrite. Imagine they'll they'll rape a child. Imagine they rape your daughter. You you don't tell me that you're gonna see those people in jail? Hell yeah. Look, don't get me wrong. Some people do need a chance to change. And and, and some people do deserve the the second chance, third chances. They always mess the first chance up. But I'm going to show you what this result and people keep living the life that they're talking about. Lupe Biasso is crying. He is crying because this dude has lost his friends. He lost his friends, man. And, and you tell me, and this is the kind of life. I don't know where it's at. It's somewhere. He he cried about Chicago. I'm trying to find it. And, and you know, all his homies are dead. All his homies he have is killers. All his homies is drug dealers. And you mean to tell me as that is a good life? It was there, but they took they took that off. And I felt I felt Lupe's pain. I really I, I, I really do. They took that stuff off. I'm sorry, you can't fend the damn hood with that mentality. And I, I, I'm gonna tell you something else. We as black people, we need to stop fending behavior. I'm sorry. Just because you're my brother sister, you need to be put down like everybody else. You take something from me, you 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 gonna get shot to death. I'm sorry. 
And that's our that's our downfall. We we want we want to be nice to everybody, but we know that everybody ain't nice. Look, after we first moved there, a damn landlord stole from us. And guess what? It's a black man. Now, it'd be different if it was a white man. If it was a white man do that, they would have fired his ass on the spot. Why is it in the black community? We'll take some from each other. But have you noticed we won't fuck with other people? No, but we know we'll go to jail or dead. We know it. The so-called Negroes know this. I'm sorry, man. Those thugs, they're the ones mess up the community and why people take childhood away from people. I'm sorry. And these women are trying to have sex with these men, but they feel sorry for them. Are they scared? I'm sorry. You can't love evil. You can't love evil. It's impossible. You can love the good, but you can't love the evil. And I learned that from the hard way. We better get at our heads and understand that something is coming if we keep on living this kind of life that we're talking about. But people don't care no more, man. They don't they, they don't give a damn. They just don't care. And they wonder why there's so much uh, 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 eruptions going on in the communities. How long is going to be more deaths? How long is it going to be more brothers and sisters are going to get shot and, and get killed? And need to start dealing with these bastards. Cho, uh, 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 Cho no, no joke, you know this, dude. You see it every day. You see brothers and sisters that's out there killing and will. I say this to white folk. No matter what you think of them, deep down, they'll fight for anything. But why black community won't do that from their people? They will never do that. Never. That I, I blame the damn church for that because we want to go out there and we want to we want to save every goddamn body. You can't save everybody now. I'm trying to find it because they took, they see, they took it off. I knew it was there. They took it off because they knew that was true. But it goes to show you, we don't give a damn about nothing. But I've been, they, they just don't care anymore. They get this thing like, you know, whatever. We always talk about it, it's the white people treating us bad. But do you think they want crime element in their goddamn community? No. I'm sorry, man. But but some of that stuff that black men are doing, they taking it too damn far. I'm sorry. You take some of me, I'm, I'm, I'm going to air your ass out. Real talk. You disrespect my family, I'm going to air you out. If you are a mother or a father, I'm sorry. We, we can't fan some of our folk. That want to out there want to rob, steal, and kill. I'm sorry. They need to be put down. If they can't put down, let the law deal with them. I'm sorry. And for you sisters, you need to think that too. Because I'm sorry. You can fend them all you want to. Let it be other, other ethnic groups. Do you think Asians and Latinos will fend their people if they do something wrong? No. They'll deal with them. We are too damn forgiving, but yet we want to go out there. And I'm going to tell you something else. That damn landlord that took some from us, yeah, took my mother's stuff. And this is a fucking black man. This is a brother. But yet we we, we, we still got faith for our brothers. No. Y'all going to keep fucking around, and y'all going to fuck around with the wrong type of people. I'm, I'm begging you now. If y'all don't get y'all act together as black men, and any men, even black women, they're going to mess around with the wrong person too. Especially Asians, Latinos, Middle East. I'm sorry. You can't fend people like that. That's like saying that German people trying to fend Hitler and what he did to the Jews. Look what he did to the Jews. On top of that, I feel bad for the people of Germany. They got to clean their ass because regardless what their what their ancestors did. It's not in here. They took it down. They took it down because they knew that what Lupe is saying is true. And I felt my, my heart goes out to Lupe. And they, and they want to talk about him saying he cried like a B-I-T-C-H. What is wrong? You are, you lost the people that are close and important to you. How can we fend a criminal behavior? I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. You can't defend that. Uh, 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 whatever his name is. Uh, 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 a joke, whatever your name is, whatever your name is, joke, choke, no joke, yeah, you can't defend that, but I'm going to show you something, and I hope you need to pay attention to this, because maybe that be your friends, 
how many brothers and sisters you lost? Where are these so-called Black Lives Matter at then? Where were they at? Where the fuck would they were? Nowhere to be found. The only time they'll come around when they get killed by a white person. So in other words, it's okay for a black person to kill their own people. No, nobody shouldn't get killed, period. Just like it's not okay for a white person to kill anyone, let alone for be a, a white person or a black person. I'm sorry, this killing got to stop. This violence got to stop. I'm sorry, man. I, I can't respect thugs for what they do. And they're going to pay for this. It really is. And that goes to women. Y'all going to pay for this trying to sleep with these kind of guys. They've been telling y'all for years, stop interacting with these people if they can't get their act together. I'm sorry. Because I'm, I'm not going to take it no more. If they take what's mine, I'm going to slice their throat. I'm dead serious. They might think I'm joking. I got some for them. I'm telling you, these street guys running around here acting like they don't give a damn, they don't care. Which worse, it's the street guys or the politicians? These politicians, they go out there and dress the people. But when the last time these street guys said, you know what, look at all the community we've done. We want to show apology and want to work with the police up and make the street better. At least that's something I, I, I give the, the game bangers doing that. They still trying to overthrow the system. Don't even realize you can't beat the system. You have to beat it financially. Not no physical damage leak. I'm sorry. You know they'll do anything to protect this system. But I don't understand this black man. Why we can't get that fucking thick skulls in our head that they plant our deaths. But 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 I'm gonna say this to you, brother. You better hope it ain't your kids. Cause I guarantee you. You rather to kill that dude. And don't say you won't, you would. They need to leave street life the fuck alone. For somebody is gonna get killed. That's all I say. But I'm gonna play this to you. You need to listen to this. I hate when they do show commercials. Sweaty. You know what I'm saying? I can't 
Bible studies in our apartment. She kept it for intellectual theory, you know what I'm saying? Someone was like, how's your hand? Oh, I'm not cool. You know what I'm saying? Like, I just go look out the window and see glass people in the corner, and then, like, turn around and be like, you know, they think of the Mark Max, you know, or whatever, you know what I'm saying? And it's crazy. Like, that's what I'm sure. Yeah. 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 Y
what every time I see that I want you to look at that choke no joke I want you to look at that but frankly you 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 don't care because you look at it well it's the hood no I'm sorry I give it a couple more years if we don't change we're gonna get the same result and that goes to anybody y'all better change or else because otherwise, they're going to put us in damn refugee camps and rip the flesh of our skin. I'm sorry. And that goes to anybody, not just my own, but white, Latino, Middle East, anybody that fin a lot of negative. And you women, you're you going to get some too. I guess y'all want martial law coming in. This is why they pushing jobs overseas. This is why that they're changing certain uh, certain. Certain certain change and certain change are better for laws, but make it better for the people out here. But y'all don't care. Y'all don't care. And, and and choke artists, you know this, man. You don't believe this, but I know you do. You see this all the time. I start to see why Beyonce and Jay Z and all the rest of them don't want it. Why would they change what goes on in the hood? They gonna end up just like MC Hammer. He went flatly broke, and the same people that helped. That he helped folk. And what they did. They turned on him. And you would think the Oakland people would say. You know what MC Hammer. Thank you. Thank you for helping us out. You did enough. They're going to tell him stop. You did enough. You can't help nobody. Just like Michael Jackson. Where are them same people that actually love Michael Jackson. But now when he's dead. Now you want to pay homage to him. I don't like people like that. We better change as a people because people brace ignorance and you will get the same result. I, I'd rather see them in jail. I'm sorry. They don't need to be getting out. And that goes to any of them community or else they're going to start taking laws now on in. Which one do you prefer? So, or, or no joke. I'm sorry. And that goes to females too. We better change or else, or else we're going to get in the same results as this. You're going to lose more friends. You're going to lose more loved ones. You're going to lose anyone else. It's just like the movie of Meteor Man when Robert Thompson told him, that, saying, how, how, you know, they expect him to save them all the time. He said, you don't have to vote. I'll leave. How are we going to act like we, we, uh, complain about the crime and gangs and we act like we don't see them? They see them all the time and they allow it to happen. The the, the, the people, the residents, allow it to go on Why the crimes are going on. And I'm sick and tired of it. When are we going to start being men? 
and t and put our differences aside. And, and I'm telling you, these other people that don't want to do right, they got to go. They got to go. Or else somebody's going to air them out. And I know I will because I'm going around a bunch of people and air them out. I'm sorry. And you women, y'all going to get there too. I'm going to get the women around them out, air y'all as well if this damn law don't, don't, don't make it better. We've been taught not to respect a damn authority. Now you got police are fed up and they're tired of it. Now don't go get me wrong. There's some bad cops. All you do do is need to file suit against them, and that's about it. You can't you can't kill a police officer. You can't kill a mason. A mason kill a mason, and police officer kill police officer. But American citizens, they ain't gonna allow that to happen. Now citizen kill a citizen. But you ain't going to kill the people that those who power be. And the only way you go kill them is financially. That's the only way you can do it. We better make hard decisions. And I, I, I agree with Harvey Superboy. He's spoken about this many a times. I even told my father he need to arm himself. And he allowed it while those two TVs are stolen in his house. But we've been taught, oh, don't snitch. Well, snitch is getting snitched. I'm sorry. We want to fend the dope dealer. You can't fend the dope dealer. And they affected that poison on your drugs. I mean, affect the poison on your children. You can't fend the murderer. You can't fend a gangster. You can't fend it. All those people need to go. Yeah, they need to get rid of uh, 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 the crooked politician. All they got to do is step down and get a better politician. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> you don't get it, do you? But sooner or later, you will get it. And understand this. There's a real reason why Jay-Z and all the rest of them did not want to help out the communities. They don't want to end up at that MC Hammer moment. And this is how MC Hammer been treated. And they should have thanked him for people that he tried to help. But what MC Hammer downfall was, he helped too many people. You can't help everybody. Just like Michael Jackson, his downfall, he helped too many folks. You only help people that those who need it. You only help one and two people, and they do the same thing for you. Other than stop doing it. I'm sorry. I used to think we all to come together as a whole, but I know in society it don't work like that. We better we 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 better change, man. I'm telling you right now. People don't give a damn anymore. Once they get that, that taste of bit that take them answer out of blood, they're too far gone, and they need to be they need to be put down, or else they need to be put in the way for good, where they won't harm another human being. I'm, I hate to say it, but Sean May got a point right there. I'm sorry, th th those days are over with. Fuck, fuck with the clan, fuck with the the Crips and I mean, fuck with the clan, fuck with the Hell's Angels. Fuck with the Japanese mafia. Fuck with the Chinese mafia. Fuck with all those people. No, you won't fuck with those people like that. Because you know they'll put your ass in the body bag. Or even worse, make your ass disappear. I want to see these so-called Negroes will do that. No, they're not going to do that. They know who to do it to. Because they know those ones are going to do something. And the ones in their community ain't going to do nothing. Because our community allowed it to go on. There's a real reason why they're single mothers. There's a real reason why they're single fathers. They want to prom promote ignorance. I'm sorry. It don't work like that. No disrespect to you, uh, Choke. Uh, Choke, no joke. I'm sorry. The, that, that thug days are over with. The real thug has come from the people of India. And where you think the word thug comes from? And I'm going to show you what the word real thug comes from. We always using these terms like thug, baller, pimp, gangster, and don't understand what these actual terms came from. Here's what a thug, a violent person, perhaps a criminal. A criminal. They are trying to say that black people fit in criminal behavior. You will never catch a white person. A white person fend a criminal behavior, they'll, they'll, they'll knock him silly if he did that and put their people in danger. People, a a common criminal who treat others violently and roughly and offer for 
a, a, a hire. Thug, probably not a member of the former India cult, Thuggy. See, this is what the term, original term thug came from. The original term thug came from. But what does it truly mean? Listen to this. Here's what the real the, here's what the real thugs at came from, ladies. Thug thuggy and tuggy and 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 hemp out and and and, and not hemp out and you thuggy and skinny and and tuggy and 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 suddenly and kiddy and kinky refer to the acts of thugs or organized crim uh, organized gang organization robbers and murderers. Thugs travel in a, in a group uh, across of S South Asia for 600 years, all all through the thugs tracing their origins to the several Muslim tri tribe, several Muslim tribe, and hi Hindu uh, appear to have been associated with them at at a a earlier period. They are the first mentioned in the upland and dust of the day, the history of and such and dated around 1356 uh, during the 1830s. Thugs are a target for illiterate by the government general of India, William Beck of Thick, and his chief uh, uh, captain, William Harold uh, uh, Sleekman. Thug or or perhaps destroyed by this effect. They was trying to overthrow the British government. This is what the word thug came from. To take advantage of their victims, the thugs would join jo uh, travelers and gain their confidence. This would allow them to surprise and strangle their victims with handkerchief or notal it. They would then robbed them and buried their victims. This led to the thugs being called and put this again. English is used as noted a term more and commonly of use in s s southern India. The, the the word thuggy derived from the Hindu uh, thundi, which means the, re the, re the which means to receive. Basically, when you don't get nothing from, from that person, they don't get nothing from these people. But they, they get something from out of the people they get. So all you women out there that say you want thug, stop saying that word because you don't know what you're saying. The word thug has come from these people. How come these rappers, they don't fuck with these people? Because people in India are going to tell you, we're the real ones. Y'all are fake ones. <sighs> we use concept, but we don't even know what it means. I bet you a lot of them don't know this. The related word of, to the Hebra of the Thugger to receive from the Utsky and Twinley and, and come to the and 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 shut it and flutter it and return it to I mean to uh, he concerned this term described the murder and, and robber of travelers is popular in South Asia and and, and part of the in India. Yeah, that's what the word thug comes from. This is what you call real thugs. They strangled they damn victims. They strangled they damn victims and earned watercolor by unknown early 19th century the artists of the three thugs to strangle a traveler. One hold his feet and other his his hands and the third one Tying the uh, uh, light of it around his neck. Yeah. So basically they massage this or get them working or stuff like that. They, they, this is what they do. They strangle their victims. These are what you call real thugs. These thugs they got today are fake. I don't know why women. They, you know how they we hear songs like, I want your thug love. Yeah. She want to be received by a man. He got something from her, but she can't get nothing from him. This is why I don't feel sorry for some women. I really don't. Because they should have known when they were young. They were ignorant when they were young. They treated you like nothing. But the other guys, they won't fuck with. Even if they wait to the last minute. I'm sorry, uh, 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 choker, no joke. You, you know this, dude.
So I guess I'm not a hood dude. That ain't me. Yeah, I came from the neighborhood. I didn't like the neighborhood where violence and interrupt and we wonder why there's no opportunity. You know what you got to go? You got to go other communities to feel safe because you can't feel safe for your own communities. No, I'm sorry. I can't wait till I have a a, 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 a protection center where we can fend ourselves and get away from, I mean, get, get rid of, of the people that we see all the time. I'm sorry. I can never look at them as my brother and sister because they could turn on me just as much as everyone else. I had a cousin right now. He murdered two people. Yeah, and took the lives. Do you think I will fend a murderer? Hell no. I don't give a damn if he was my cousin. He should have never thought about what he did. Now he got to live like live with that the rest of his life. And he still wear a leg bracelet and something tell me he going back to prison. We already know. Because nobody wants to hire a convict, but especially nobody wants to hire a murderer. Okay? You think they'll hire a criminal biker man? No. Why is it that black community and anyone else, they want to, you never hear other ethnic groups fend of criminal behavior. They, they never done this. But wh why is it that in the black community, you hear people say, uh, free my brother, free my sister, free my father, free my mother. Free for what? Now, don't get me wrong. There's some innocent people in prison, but every prison is not innocent. I'm sorry. Some people just want to get out. They don't want to be in prison. Well, you shouldn't have been doing what you know. Let me say this. We better change, though, because otherwise, this time, they're not going to put us in prison. They're going to put us in torture camps if we keep on where we're going. It's, it's bad enough that every time I order a pizza, you can't even get a pizza uh, in your own communities. I bet you I'm in other communities I get them. But but when this area, no. Because they look at it, it's too damn dark, people are afraid, and all this stuff. And, and you can't blame them. See, that made people do not want to do business in the community. They need to get rid of that criminal element, that crime rate in the communities. Nobody wants to feel that they're not safe of an area that people might do harm them or jack them or even killed them and stuff like that. We need to stop finning stupid people out there. And you know it. So let me get this straight. If a if a if a man kill a three year old month year old child, do you think you're gonna offend that? Oh, come on man. Of course not. You would not offend it. You would not. I can't wait till all them thugs need to be taken down. All of them. The so called drug dealers, gangsters, hustlers, murder, all of them. Even the so called racists. But see, they ain't going to fuck with the racists because they know that those kind of people they just ain't going to cross with. White people ain't stupid enough trying to fend, a per, especially a white man, a white woman, to fend stupid criminal behavior and done some damage to their people. No, they're going to deal with them. Do you think Latino men and Latino women going to fend their people with the criminal behavior? No, they're going to take them out. I even saw a couple of Mexican brothers and sisters that actually fight for their country and, and fight it for for their land of Mexico and try to take the the drug cartels down, and 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 they did successfully. Just like the goddamn Africans would take criminals down in their community, and so is people of Russia of the Russian government take the criminal element down. I'm sorry, man. This has got to stop. There's a real reason why all these other ethnic artists. There's a real reason why Oprah. There's a real ride. Jay Z and and Jay Z and all the rest of these people don't want to help out their community because they feel like some people just don't want to be helped. You can't help your people because they're gonna turn on you at some point. And we always talk about white people is the enemy, but white people got their own damn issue. At least they, they'll fight for what they believe in. That's one thing I learned from them. White folks are a rational race. Black people are emotional. They're emotional. You say something wrong to a black man and black woman, you are gonna get your ass cussed out. We need to grow up or else or we're going to get to keeping the same result and we're going to look back a couple more years later and say, what the fuck are we thinking? Black men going to keep asking themselves and black women going to ask themselves too. Somebody going to pay. You better change or else or else we're going to get the same results we ain't going to get.
But I know I, I know I am. I'm sorry. They got to get out of the way. And they need to be gone for good. And get rid of the hood mentality. Those days are gone. And that's all I can say about that. It's your boy, Domination. There's a back of the base. The drug of the deuce is out of the two text, baby. Until next time. All right. All right. Peace. I'm out. All right. Peace.